Hey guys, this is a demo that I had promised uh, some of you that uh, as we start using more and more um, webinar-like formats that uh, we want to make sure that, that we're providing kind of the best experience possible for the recipients or the, the watchers of those webinars. I figured I'd do this in a kind of a public video too, so if anyone else could actually benefit from it, that would be cool. Um, so just to kind of set the stage, uh, you know, this is predominantly a Mac um, set up and so for all the Windows people out there that's probably going to apply for you. Um, so what we want to really kind of do is set the stage for doing demos for our product, uh, RiskKey. And uh, some of the things that I noticed with some of the other webinars is that they could definitely be um, a little bit cleaner. And so I just wanted to go through some of the things that I do to kind of prepare for it. Uh, first thing, uh, first things first is that everything that's on my desktop I tried to clean out. I don't like to have a bunch of files or folders um, in the background. Uh, I like to put them all in a folder somewhere or whatever the case may be just to kind of not show the clutter. Um, kind of see that like sweeping it under the rug sort of thing and so just put it in a folder you could go back to it later but uh, get it out of the way secondly is since we're doing mainly browser type of demos uh, I noticed this with some of the other ones that I was dealing with people had download you know lists a handful of things here uh, make sure that you definitely go this is a Firefox add-on that some people have make sure that that's you know definitely gone so they can see as much of the screen as possible uh, secondly, there's really no need for them to see the address bar and um, you know these bookmarks, and so I use uh, the minimize menu option up here at the top right to actually collapse that. So all you really have is your tabs. Um, secondly, I want to make sure that I'm scrolled up to the top and already logged in to the app, so we can. Uh, show the demo straight away versus logging into it and all that. I even generally in presentations that are offline, I build up a bunch of tabs here so I can click through. I don't have to worry about uh, load times and that sort of thing if time is of the essence. Um, the last thing, a couple of things that I do, one is I actually come down to the menu bar here and I hide it and so I just right click and you have to right click on this little line here and then turn hiding on and so that way it gets it out of the way and you can maximize your screen where it actually shows the entire uh, just the browser now nothing really else is affecting it there's nothing to to muddy the viewing uh, so now you can do your demo the only other thing that I'll add on the display side is make sure that you're running in a resolution that is going to be workable for everybody and so what I generally do is that I'll go to uh, the display preferences and you can get there through, let me bring this down, you can go through system preferences and then go to display here and then just make sure that your resolution, I'm running on a 30 inch monitor so this is going to be way too big for most people, they're not going to be able to see it so I generally lower it down to a 1024 by 768 and then maximize my browser once I've switched that resolution. Uh, if you're using multiple monitors this is something you definitely want to do. Um, and so once I have all those set up, uh, I'm basically ready to go. Uh, it's a pretty straightforward process. It's now uh, just focusing on the demo. You don't get hung up with you know what's on people's desktops, what things do they have downloaded, what apps are they running, uh, that sort of thing. And so we focus on the app, and I think that's what's going to show it off the best. So I'm happy to answer any other questions that you have. Uh, this is just so you know running on Firefox 3.5, I think. Um, there's no reason you couldn't do it in a Safari or um, anything else. So anyway, there you go. Have a great day, everybody.